everyone. Welcome or welcome back. My name is Lauren and I'm the artist behind Garden Girl Studio. Today is Friday, August 4th. And in this vlog, I'm going to take you behind the scenes at my quilting studio. So today we are heading out to my parents' house where I do most of my quilting. I have my big long arm machine there. And today we're going to be working on some market prep. I have to get so much market prep done that I've been chipping away at it every single week because it takes so long to produce quilted and hand sewn products. So I we're heading over there. Today is going to be market prep day and we are going to be making some table runners. So my goal is to get two table runners done. Basically, it's going to be one piece of fabric. We are going to quilt it up and we are going to try to get that done today. And if that goes smoothly, then I am going to see if we can start working on embroidered ornaments. Now I've been hand stitching my ornaments, which I love and it's a ton of fun, but it's very time consuming. So my mom happens to have an embroidery machine. So we're going to test it out and see if we can do some of the base lettering work on her machine. And then I can hand stitch in some details, some florals, some accents, some fun embellishments that are my, more my style. So hopefully we'll get both things done. I'm going to take you on that adventure and we're going to head out right now. Hey friends, we are at the quilting studio. So I'm at my parents' house. This is my long arm machine. This is what we're gonna be sewing on today. So basically if you've never seen a long arm sewing machine before, I can stitch in any direction with this machine. So the fabric stays still and the machine moves rather than having a stationary machine that stays on a table and we move the fabric. So this gives me some pretty cool control when I'm sewing. So I'm excited about that. Uh, to give you an idea of what we're working on, let me show you, I made some placemats. So this is gonna be table runners. It's gonna actually be two table runners, but I'll show you the placemats we made. They're gonna kind of coordinate. So let me show you those. So I'll show you the backside. So we're gonna be doing vine work. Ooh, good lighting, there we go. But you can see we're going to be stitching cool different patterns and designs all the way down the table runners. I'm going to go ahead and start setting up the machine. We're going to do some test patching to make sure that everything's right before we get stitching all of the fun patterns and designs. So here we go. We're gonna be going row by row. So basically I've stitched down some channels and then in the larger spaces, we're gonna be doing all of the fun decorative quilting, uh, starting with a meander and then we're gonna work from there. I'll show you some of the designs we do. If there's certain ones you wanna see, drop them in the comments below and I'll see if I can do them up. I like a challenge. So if there's certain quilting designs that you wanna see free motion quilted, I will do my best. I'm gonna be working both free motion, hand guided and some ruler work. None of these are going to be computer designs. These are all me moving the machine, whether it be with a ruler or just me free flowing. So I hope you enjoy. I'll kind of keep you posted as I go. Fingers crossed that it all goes smoothly.
so good news we got through the quilting on this beauty this is a single yard so it should make up two tabletop runners for us we need to weave in all of the threads so anywhere we had to break thread or uh, anytime thread broke we have little tails little thread tails so we've got to go ahead and weave those in cut this into two runners and bind it so but the quilting's done the quilting is done Yay, quilting. So I'm going to go take a lunch break and then we'll see if we can get another one of these done or work on a little bit of embroidery. We'll see what the afternoon brings. So <laughs> going to work through that and I'll see you after lunch. Hey everyone, so we made it back home. Today we got through two table runners. We're calling them, they're the shorter table runners, so we're calling them the coffee table table runners. They're a little bit shorter than our long table runners. And we got through all 26, an entire alphabet's worth of letters for ornaments, so I'm so excited about that. When I work on those letters by hand, it takes me about an hour to 90 minutes per letter. So having the machine to be running in the background is a super help. So tonight I'm going to have some dinner, probably get into some comfy clothes, and I'm going to stitch some extra florals or sparkles or just little extra accents around those letters to make them a little bit more special and fun to kind of put my own little spin on them. So I'm going to go ahead and work on that tonight with probably a good podcast or audiobook. If you have recommendations, go ahead and drop it in the comments. Let me know what you're listening to. And until next time, uh, we're going to wrap it up here, so I'll talk to you later, friends, until the next vlog.